Good to see you, Scratch Ticket fans. Yours truly, Idaho Scratcher. T with T at T Productions for Fall of All Fun. Holiday edition, Climb the Ladder. Yes, it's almost time for Thanksgiving as the filming of this video. And, well, we're going to make it holiday themed. Yes, we have Christmas tickets, but we do not have any Thanksgiving tickets, which is, you know, I think it's obvious. It's short. These holidays, you got to pick them which ones you want. And the ones you want to have are you going to have, you know, your uh, Halloween. You're going to have Christmas. So, this time we have Christmas. There it is. So, climb the ladder. Grab five $1 tickets. Scratch them. You take what you win. Go higher up the lottery ladder. How far will you go? We're going to find out how far we go. And, like always, I would like to thank our current members. A shout out to them. Thank you for joining us. Hit that join button if you'd like to see what all the fun's about. We will look forward to seeing you. And we'll try to have some fun together. 125 through 121, and there they are right there. We are going to count down, because that is actually how I see them. So, holiday follow -up fun has not been very much fun lately. It's always been a little bit small, chintzy even. Reveal a candy cane symbol, you'll get the prize. Reveal that Christmas tree symbol, you'll get double. Two symbols for the price of one. How cool is that? Went up to a thousand bucks. This is actually one of our good odds on this one. One, two, three, zero. And then the diversity of prizes can get up to a $10 winner in a pack of 300. Mm. One $10 winner in a pack of 300. Sounds to me like there's a lot of one and two dollar winners. Hmm. That is exactly what it does, but it's great for getting more lottery. And that's what we want to do today. We will attempt to do that. How many winners will we find today? Oh, by the way, you can also get uh, both symbols on this ticket. I managed to get like $5 on the ticket that way. There's a G sting of death and we have no symbol. So there, therefore, when you see a G, it usually means a loser. Let's first get the losing out of the way and that means we have all winners now. <laughs> or so we think, we can hope. That is what we can hope. There's the candy cane. Like I said, get the losing out of the way. Well, now that is cool. Ah, we're going for the jugular on the holiday fall of fun. <laughs> now I like that. That is a $3 winner, folks. Remember what I said? A lot of $1 and $2 winners. But now I actually found a $3 winner. Cool. Instantly, we get a $3 ticket. And it's just, just like skip the second tier, you know, the $2 tier, and go right up to the $3 tier. That's pretty cool. Can we get some more? I say yes. We have plenty of tickets to do it. One in three to actually win a buck. So we could have four. Unless, of course, the next three tickets, of course, are all winners. And I have actually had that. I've actually had four winning tickets out of five. So that is why these tickets are so fun up here in Idaho with the $1 tickets. We are able to get a lot of winners out of them. That is a snowflake. Nothing on that one. So we still have that $3 winner on ticket 124. Ticket 122 after ticket 123. It's kind of cool that we actually got that. Okie dokie. Now we see, wow, an H. And a C sting of death. Okay. Well, if that's the way it's going to be. That's the way it's going to be. I can't change their minds on that. Got that losing out of the way. Let's see if we can't find one more winner. Come on, 121. You got a whole bunch of things going for you. Let's see. One more winner. No, we're not. So we only had one winner. Just one. I thought it was going to really show up today. Well, sometimes you're wrong. Maybe I should have bought that last ticket. Ugh, then I would have gotten the dollar. Well, so one ticket shows up all the rest. So we get one winner and four losers. I have had that before, but at least we did not get the standard, you know, $2, $7 lottery for five bucks. Now we actually have eight. Oh, what will I do with that? Well, stay tuned. You're going to find out. I'll be right back. And I'm back. And sure enough, I climbed the ladder. One winner for three bucks. Got the fall holiday fall of fun. She finally pops off and gives us something. And I get the $3 Red Sevens Bingo. Why would I do that? 
<laughs> our $3 tickets usually blow, but sometimes they don't. So we look for our lines completed with a red seven, double the prize. Let's see if we can't do that. $30,000 top prize. We got four little cards to play. Sweet. Ticket number 60. Odds on this ticket are a wild nasty. <laughs> one and three, four, six. Not too bad. I mean, you know, some of our tens are still sitting around one and three, five. But it's the three, five, six, eight, ten, and all this diversity of prizes that makes it happen. Because all these cards, what you want to do is fill that card right there. That's the big one. One line is $20. And I know that we can't really win 20 bucks, but hey, I can always dream. So... I do. <laughs> ah, don't stop dreaming, people. Once you start settling, you'll never get it back. Okie dokie. Here we go. Something good, please. I went and took a risk on this ticket. It's one of my dangerous ones, I should say. I want to make sure I don't go too far down to the bottom there. Probably wind up pulling out some of those little nasty numbers. Just want to make sure I get around it, see if there's no more letters. Okay, yeah, there's no more. All right, sometimes they do. They put some one right over there and one right down here, and you'll miss them all. And then I'm just trying to avoid those little spoilers, little spoiler letters. All right, let's look for some Bs. Two, three, eleven. All right, two, three, eleven. Nothing there. Nothing there. All right, nothing there. There's eleven. All right, at least this is actually still scratches. Two, three, and eleven. Oh, I didn't grab any of that. I guess the seven is free. I only got a couple of spots. I got one on each spot, so I guess that's pretty cool. All right, let's see what we've got here. We've got uh. Only one B on the second line. Ooh, that's just an eight. And I only see another one H. Yeesh. All right. Come on. Six and 14. Oh, God. no, we don't. Yeah, we do. We have them down here. I'd like to see one of these bingo games actually pop off. You know how they are. Tough. <laughs> if you said that, you're right. People play them, though, with all the high hopes. Let's go to I. Only one eye on the top. Hmm. 29. Let's go for it. I get a 29 on all of them. Yes. All right. I'll, you most likely win on this one right over here. That's the low line. So hopefully we can get the one down there. Let's see, 26, 27, 28. Ooh. <laughs> 26, 27, and 28. Yeah, I like that. Uh-oh, it's starting to dry up right there. There's a 27. Come on, hit this big card down here. I haven't won anything down there before. As a matter of fact, the only times I've ever won on a bingo ticket, on a $3 ticket, is right over here. And maybe I might get, like, you know, a line. <laughs> I'd like to see the four corners or an X on there. That's when it gets bigger. Over here, it's really big. You get an X over here, you get it the whole 30000 bucks. All right, that'll be cool. 
Ooh, not a single eye on that third line. Ooh, that's dangerous. I don't like that. Let's go for some ends. Let's go for some ends now. North, 35. Let's do it. <laughs> and 35. All right. Don't leave me. Come on. Don't treat me wrong. N36. Gonna go short. That's what they're gonna do. Come on. Give us something. When was the last time that I had a... On climb the ladder, did I have a ticket like this pop off? It was a $3 ticket that took us up to 18 bucks and made us skyrocket to like $64 a lottery for like 2 bucks. That was really good. All right, any more ends? N40. Mm, oh, they're going to leave us. Gonna leave us hanging. At 32. Darn. All right. Take that N40. Oh, wow. Look how... Oh, it's 32 down there, too. That's going to cut us off. And it's the 38 on this one. 38. Boy. That is a bummer. So close, yet so far. All right. G's are coming up. We got 47 and 55. Nothing. Forty-seven, fifty, and fifty-five. Okay, forty-seven, fifty, fifty-five. Forty-seven, fifty, fifty-five. All right. Forty-seven, fifty, and fifty-five. Here we go. We're going to open up all these lines and have nothing. How about 46? 46. There it is. Seen this so many times. You think you're going to get something good and then it doesn't. All right, 48 and 54. These generally don't shoot off. 48 and 54. Forty-eight, fifty-four. All right. Oh, gets uglier by the moment. Here we go. Final. The oh boy. <laughs> Zero sixty-one. So we are going to have to get ourselves a sixty-one here. Ooh. 68, 74. So we got 66, 68, 74. 66, 78. Okay, 74. 66, 68, 74. 66, 68, 74. All right, we're down to the last one. 
And that is it. Didn't grab anything. Now, like always, I scan these because on bingos, it is very easily to skip things. But I guess that's where we're at. <laughs> we got eight for five. But we had a whole bunch of fun. At least I did. Anytime that we're able to get more lottery than what we pay for, that is exactly what we want. And that's what we like to show on Climb the Ladder. That makes sure that your $5 in lottery right there turns into eight. And you don't lose more than five bucks. That's it. But I got to play eight dollars worth of lottery. What if this one did pop off? That's the question. What if it did win 30,000 bucks? You only spent five dollars on this one to play that, to play eight. And you win 30,000 bucks. That is climb the ladder. Make your lottery dollars go farther and do it for less. Climb the ladder. Thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, share. Let me know what you like and what you don't. And hey, we do this kind of stuff all the time. I only do this about once a week. And you have seen some pretty impressive wins. Pretty impressive amounts of lottery. All for the beginning five bucks. Sometimes for free. And sometimes for... I end up getting... Uh, Less money. I ain't getting the for doing this for less money. So sometimes you'll see me actually do uh, eight dollars on lottery for like two bucks, or for free, or sometimes they actually pay me to play lottery. And it's just sick. Yes, I haven't been able to get paid a lot of money. I think that about the most I've ever been paid is like five dollars or something like that to pay like play like eighteen bucks. It's something like that. But there you have it. I'll see you again, and we'll do this again. Till then, you guys stay safe. Bye-bye.